This is Channel 7 News. This is Lanny York reporting for Channel 7 News. In a story of heroism and courage, Adam Wolf is safe thanks to T Zero hero Nick Mason. Mason rescued Wolf from his kidnappers with the help of emergency services. Wolf has released a statement vowing to stop the gangs once and for all. Shift it will crush the city. That shocking statement from Lucian Hotspeed, previous leader of a faction of the Burners. Since his arrest, Hotspeed has confirmed that Shift It was involved in Adam Wolf's kidnapping. Hotspeed told the FBI that Shift It formed an army to show America that it's vulnerable and weak. In response, police raided Shift It offices this morning and found weapons and attack plans. Now it appears company officials are the masterminds of the gang attacks. Many of its employees are missing, including CEO Amon Kang. In other breaking news, T-Zero hero Nick Mason's home was firebombed early this morning. Mason was on duty at the time and was uninjured in the attack. Finally, some positive news for Mayor Wyatt. The allegations of his involvement in gang torture have been revealed as completely false. The claims were traced to Gabe Peeps. Peeps planned to discredit the mayor and then run for office himself. He was arrested today in Panama. We've just been informed of another gang attack. This time, Angel Heights, which is known as the Dangerous Housing Project, has been overrun by gangs. Emergency workers are trapped inside. T-Zero is on the scene. More on this story as it unfolds. Channel 7, first for news in your city. Thank God you're here. There are burners everywhere. A couple of officers made an advance into the area and got taken down. I need your help getting to them, but the burners have a massive chain gun defending the area. We can't get out there until someone takes out that bastard on the chain gun. I'm gonna stay here until you've taken out that chain gun. Come back if you're catching up. Lead the way, Mason. Okay, Nick. According to the satellite images, it looks like there are civilians trapped in the burning building to the right. I am coordinating back up to the other oh, services in your area. Fire crews are en route. Once they arrive, you can proceed into the building and try to rescue any civilians He's trapped here, inside. Come Take them out!
them over here! Take them out. Oh. I need a medic, Nick! Mason, over here! Cover us while I get Curtis back up on his feet. Okay, I've patched Curtis up enough so we can move him. Take us back to the underpass so I can continue to work on him. Mason, escort the medic and officer Daniels back to the underpass. These guys are insane! Take them out! This'll make it better. We'll be fine. Man, am I glad you're watching my back.
No problem. It's done. Watch out! Dispatch, this is Unit 15. I'm on. Get down or acquire backup now. Unit 15, back up. Order complete. Way. Hang in there. Look out! Okay. It's done. I'm on it. Back draft door! Get down! Stop yeah. I'm coming! Oh. Stop shooting me! No problem. Die, pig! Order complete. Back me up. I'm hit. Okay. Okay. Order complete. No problem. It's done. Okay. Order complete. I'm on it. There he is. Help me, please. Done. I'll get him.
Put him down there, please, Doug. Do you need medical assistance? Good work, Nick. I'm gonna help out my crew now. Okay. Come back when you need help. like you could use some help. You're gonna be fine, you hear? Listen, <sighs> I've only got one pack left, so try and be a little bit more careful. going to be okay. Don't worry. You need help? Okay. Come back when you need help. 
Quick! Get over here! You seen anything Quick. like this before? Get over here! Hey, Mason! Looks like you've been busy. Have you thought of not killing everyone you see? Anyway, there's a cop back there. An officer, Jim Holiday, says his partner was dragged down into the parking garage. Jones can get you into there. The rest is up to you. It's dangerous down there, man. This should make you feel better. You need hey, to go and I save the police officer who was dragged into the parking garage. I don't know how you guys put up with injuries like those. <sighs> yeah, now this should make you feel better. Reloading. You are gonna die! Give yourself up, man! There's no escape! This will help with the pain. Quick! 
Get over here! Remember to keep your weapon loaded at all times. Hey, Mason! Looks like you've been busy! Uh, you thought of not killing uh, everyone you see? Uh, Stop back there! Hey, An officer he just he said his partner was dragged down into the parking garage. Hey, uh, Mason! Mason will get you into this! The rest get is up to you! Stay down there, man! You're gonna be okay. Don't worry. It's gotta hey, be here somewhere. I could help you with that. Maybe we missed a room back there. Take this. It'll stop the pain. You'll be fine.
zero tolerance. Thanks, Mason. The bastard grabbed me after they rammed my vehicle off the road. Hope my partner's okay. Let's go and shut this place down once and for all! Nice work! Now let's move! Under here! See if you can get to that chain gun! Use it against these bastards! Nick, we really earned our pay today. This is Steve George, reporting live for Channel 7 over the burning shell of the Angel Heights housing project. As you know, I've been skeptical of T-Zero, but all that changed when I watched T-Zero in action. Nick Mason was like some kind of machine as he single-handedly took down a burner gun emplacement before turning it on the gang in the climax to a brutal battle that left many of our city's finest dead or wounded. Do I think the politics of T-Zero are correct? I still don't know. What is certain, however, is this. Nick Mason is a real hero, and I, for one, won't be saying another word against him. Now, back to Lonnie in the studio.